Several years ago, we were doing our cover crops and we were planting them with a, your, your drill and it just, we weren't terribly happy with the placement and how, the, how they were coming out of the ground and just the population that we were getting. And so we knew there had to be a better way that would work for our operation to, to put those in. And so we did some research and made some adjustments on our planter that we use for corn and beans. And so we've got a diverse mix now of radish, vetch, and lentils because they are similar seed size for our vacuum planter. And so we place them with our planter in 20 inch rows. And uh, we end up with, you know, a precision planting cover crop through the field that we can follow with corn or beans the next year. And that cover crop, you know, captures those nutrients in the soil and holds it it's almost it's almost like strip till but you know i call it that bio strip you know you've got this natural action from these plants that are digging deep down breaking up compaction while still providing those nutrients in that zone for the next year so that when i come back and plant our corner of beans i'm going to be within try to be within three four inches of that that strip and those roots for those that next year's crop does not have to look very far to find those nutrients that it needs and obviously with the radishes growing deep down in the soil it's a easy root zone for the corn of the beans to follow and dig deep down in the soil for not only water but more nutrients and I, I think it's been working real well for us and uh, I'm kind of excited to see how it continues over the next five ten years because we're only in year three of it and you learn something every year make a minor adjustment here or there but what we've seen so far is we're able to withstand those weather extremes even better with, with that strip tail in there. The farm economy is hard. The diversity helps keep things even. You plant wheat, you've got income in August. If you can increase your cattle production, you've got a bigger calf check. You're spreading out your risk and you're, you're spreading out your wealth also.